Oh, hello. This is Tak Chung from Walk with Tak. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and share. In this video, I'm going to reveal a walk that I recently found on Amazon. It's made by a company called Lolly Cage. Now, this walk is unusual from the standpoint is that the handle of the walk is detachable. Now, most walks come with a handle. Frequently, I call them a frying pan handle. It's a long handle. And if you have a wok that is 13 or 14 inches in size, uh, this handle make it uh, very difficult, uh, for example, for the wok to store. Now for me, storage is not much of a problem because I always hang my wok on the wall. However, I like to have a wok that with a detachable handle so that I can pack them into a carrying on suitcase. The reason for that is that uh, quite often I will go visit friends and I will bring my wok with me so that I can cook in their house. So having a wok with a detachable handle is very handy and I have been always looking for such a wok, uh, particularly in the case of a standard steel wok. Now this wok I found on Amazon and it is about $49. As it is listed right here, I, I bought mine about 40 when they have a sale. Uh, this is a 13 inch wok and uh, if you remove the handle, it is small enough for you to pack into a suitcase. Now the wok is very well constructed as most stainless steel wok are. It is a free ply construction. What free ply construction means that it has stainless steel uh, on both inside and the outside, but in the middle of the wok there is a layer of aluminum. The aluminum uh, is uh, effective for make the wok better in terms of uh, overall heating as well as uh, the speed for the wok to be heated up. Now this wok has almost like a near round bottom. However, the exterior bottom of this wok is completely flat, so you can use it on any range with a flat surface, such as a glass top electric range, uh, as well as on a induction cooktop where there is a flat surface. Now the wok has only one handle and the handle is a stainless steel handle. But the handle is uh, well designed that it just stay cool so it will not get hot. Now this wok do not have a helper handle which normally you will find in many uh, 13 or 14 inch wok. There's a small handle on the other side. Uh, this handle will help you if you have something in the wok that is heavy, make it difficult for it to carry. I really like the weight of this wok. Uh, this wok weighs about three pound four ounces. And I think the reason that it does not weigh more than this is because it probably do not have the helper handle that will reduce several ounces. In comparison to my Cusina 14 inch standard steel wok, which is my everyday wok, uh, the, this wok is about four ounces heavier than the Cusina wok, which, which is not bad at all. And I really like uh, this weight. Now this wok is all standard steel construction. So you can put this wok in the oven and according to the information provided by the manufacturer, the wok can be hit up to a temperature of 500 degrees Fahrenheit. Now the wok comes with a glass cover. Now it's a, this is a very nice glass cover. Uh, the one thing I really like about this cover is that it has a vent hole, which I do not have in my Cusina 14 inch wok, which also come with a glass cover but without the vent hole. Having the vent hole is very useful uh, because it will allow steam to escape, particularly if I want to do some slow cooking. Next step is for me to install the handle. Now, the wok come with two bolts on the side of the wok, and all I have to do is to take the handle and attach handle to those bolts. And then I have a nut which I can screw onto the bolt. Uh, in fact, uh, the wok came with a wrench that I can use it to uh, attach the bolt onto the screw. And it is fairly easy to do that. In fact, uh, I can uh, have a very firm attachment. And after I tighten it, it feels very secure. I do not have any worry that it's going to come off. Uh, the wok is very easy uh, to use and I have no problem in washing it. It's a brand new wok. It's beautiful wok. So the first step before I'm going to test uh, the function of this wok is I wash it. I just wash it in the water with a little bit of soap. Now, the best way to uh, test a wok is that to uh, make sure that this wok is easily seasoned. 
and I'm going to use my spot seasoning method. Uh, this method is very simple. All I have to do uh, is to uh, heat up the oil uh, until it starts to smoke gently. And I'm going to let it smoke for about 15 seconds. This is what I'm going to do. Actually, uh, if you let it smoke longer, the wok is better seasoned. But I'm going to try it with 15 seconds. Uh, I put two eggs in the wok and I let the egg to fry for about maybe a minute without moving it so that the uh, side of the egg will in touching the wok will be properly fried and this will allow them to be easily uh, removed. So as you can see, when I use my wok spatula, I'm having some difficulty in uh, removing the egg. I'm not surprised because this is the first time I use the wok. And quite often when you first season the wok, it usually do not season as well. So in this case, there's two things you can do. One is that you can season it a bit longer by let the oil to smoke up to say 30 seconds. Now, as you probably um, noticed that uh, when I fry the egg, uh, the oil actually smoke gently because um, the egg do not you take up a lot of heat. So during this time period, it actually continue to season the wok. So my prediction is that when I fry the second egg, the egg will not stick to the wok at all because the wok is now better seasoned. Uh, as you can see, and that indeed is the case, uh, my second egg do not stick to the wok at all. So based on that, I'm confident that this wok can be easily seasoned as like all other stainless steel wok and you can uh, create a non stick cook surface using this method. A lot of time uh, people have concern when they uh, use a wok on the glass top electric stove which has a flat surface or use a uh, induction cooktop because you do not want the wok to wobble and that's one reason that a lot of time people do not use carbon steel wok on this type of flat surface because carbon steel wok once it warm up uh, heated up it will start to uh, have a slight shape change and it will cause it to wobble. Now this wok has no problem of its wobbling, it sits very firmly, but there's one small problem is that it tends to spin. Uh, I think this is probably due to the fact that uh, the wok is brand new and the surface is very slick. And I think after one use it for a while, it probably will not spin anymore. The wok is very easy to clean. I clean the wok, I use my uh, bamboo wok brush and I have no problem in uh, cleaning whatever it has. And then at the end, uh, I use my uh, scotch bright uh, heavy duty scrub sponge. And that works very well to remove any stain that might remain on the surface of the wall. So overall, I'm happy with this walk. It performed uh, very nicely. I wish that it has a helper handle, but I understand why it did not have one because it uh, will take up extra space. The walk very well constructed. I like the cover of the wok and also uh, I'm surprised that it only weighs three pound four ounces even though it is a free ply wok. So my conclusion is that I will recommend this wok to anybody who would like to have a wok that with a removable handle so they can travel with the wok or for better and easier storage. But you need to remember the handle is attached by screws. So you cannot just simply press a button and to remove the handle, although it does come with a wrench for you to attach the screw. If that is what you want, then this walk will work extremely well. And I decided I'm going to keep this walk because I think there are times uh, when I do cooking classes or I want to travel to my friend's uh, house on the plane, this walk will allow me to carry it with me. Uh, please email me at walkwithtar at gmail.com if you have any question regarding this video or any other video that I have in the past. Uh, through email, I will be able to provide you a more thorough answer and I will reply your email promptly. Okay, so uh, I post a video each day to help you to make home cooking as part of your daily routine using my fast cooking system. And the word fast stands for flavor chasing advanced prepping, stir-frying, and template-based cooking. If you'd like to learn more about this cooking system, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. So keep on cooking. I will see you tomorrow.